what's up y'all it's King Rancher 13 welcome back to another video so we got the truck pulled into the shop as y'all saw my dad and Colin are working on getting the offices finished up paint is up next so before we do that you can cut some baseboards and some door trim and just miscellaneous stuff but we got a pretty exciting video um, this is a part that I've had for months and months and I, pro I probably bought it back in a uh, about August last year for my 250 but I never got around to making the video I never got around to putting the part on so finally we're gonna be unboxing this and uh, real quick if y'all are watching for the first time we appreciate you coming around make sure to hit that subscribe button uh, because we got some cool videos going on hopefully I think they're cool but make sure to hit that like button and comment down below and always let us know what you thought about the video and and all that kind of stuff or anything you have questions about try to comment below and I'll see if I can answer them to the best that I can. But before we get going, the part that we're putting on is in this box. Before I get unboxing on the part there, the little reason why we're getting this part is because as of right now, all of us, we use this cord thing. And for me, I always like to have this closed. There's always this line coming out and a little crack. There's some guys that will stick a a Dremel in here and Dremel that out, but I mean, I don't like to cut up into anything. So with that being said, um, this is going to allow us to be able to do Apple CarPlay wirelessly. So I don't know if y'all have seen anything like this on the market, but um, I came across it and I was like, all right, let me just try it out. And we're going to cut this thing open. The reason why I'm opening this upside down is because my address is on the other side. Oh. But here it is. So I'm not too sure how exactly this works or anything, but uh, I reckon we're fixing to find out. Let me take the plastic off. That should probably help. Ooh, shiny. Oh, not shiny. It's matte finish. <laughs> There we go. That's how you have to open it, by the way. Let's shake it. Oh, okay. So, this is what the part looks like. I'm just gonna go ahead and take this off because it's coming off already. Just plastic stuff. Go ahead and take this off too. Here's for all you uh, satisfaction people. Oh, there's one more. Oh, bonus pee. All right. User manual. User, user manual. Change the original wired CarPlay connection method to this thing. So I just plug this, if y'all can see. Does that show up in the video? Yeah, okay. I get it. Sure. All right. So this now goes in here like this, like so. Plugged in. Oh, it's got a USB on this side, so I guess you can still use a port to charge your phone if you desire. Okay, and then now that it's plugged in, connect USB dongle to the car's USB port, click search, then turn on the iPhone's Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. Okay, there we go. Oh wait, hold up, something came up. All right, so this is what popped up. I'm gonna press continue, press agree. So I got a Bluetooth, other devices, there we go, wait. That's Volks. Wait, do you have a Volkswagen? No, your car's no. not even here. I don't have a Volkswagen. I have a Nissan. Okay, well, <laughs> okay, that's... Yes, it's Volkswagen. All right, and there we go. We're connected now and on the screen. Look at that. There we go. Wireless CarPlay. I'm jealous. I need to get this from my car. Waze, Safari. wireless so one thing i heard on the reviews is that it might take a few seconds to connect so let's try that out. i'm gonna turn the truck off and then now i'm gonna open the door so it turns it turns off the screen completely from what i know all right now exit out all my apps so the truck is off all my apps are off and i'm gonna have my phone off because normally I don't have my phone screen on right when I get in my truck. Oh, I mean, it depends, but all right, let's uh, start the truck up. Let's 
Let's see if CarPlay. Connect. It, oh, it's auto connecting. And then connecting. And I'm not doing anything, by the way. I just turn my phone screen on now. So it's connecting. And just there like that. Is. So I don't know how many seconds. How many seconds was that? Maybe like five, ten yeah, seconds. Maybe about ten, ten most, seconds. Yeah. So ten second delay, but I mean, ten seconds is nothing. Like you know, usually I'm buckling up my seatbelt now that y'all called me up. I'm not <laughs> wearing my seatbelt. I'm fidgeting with whatever, turning my tow haul mode or whatever. Or sometimes I'll be sitting here shooting text or whatever. Anyways, so like ten seconds, that's like nothing to wait to have app. You know, wireless carplay. So I'm gonna try this pass through USB port and see if uh, the charger works like should as well. Let's see. So now I kicked that carplay off, but now it came back on. So not sure really. Oh, okay. I see here. So if you have it plugged in, it's gonna work as if you're plugged in there. But if you don't have this plugged in, it's gonna run wirelessly. I think that's gonna okay. how it goes. So, forgive me if I'm not right on all my information, but <laughs> that's pretty cool. Like, I wanna try out and see how far the CarPlay will work from. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Shoot me a honk if if this screen turns off. Jeez Louise. Oh, there it was. Okay, so what happened? It just went straight to this. Cut out, and yeah. now it's back. Oh, there now it goes. it's back. Okay, <laughs> so I paced back, and it's 31 steps, or about 31 yards, roughly, I'm, if, if my steps are <laughs> a yard. So, about 31 yards. It wasn't too bad. Mm -mm. I thought you were gonna have to like go to like a website, log in, or do something. Yeah. I've, I've heard of that kind of stuff like, before. I guess it's a Chinese product, because it's, it said, connect to a Volkswagen, like, yeah, her. Where's where, where Volkswagen at? <laughs> yeah. So now I can have this completely closed all the time, and I can put this into here if I. Oh, uh, yeah, don't mind all the mess and stuff. <laughs> but I can put it into this cigarette port right there and have it. And you see these channels right here where you can run your cord out like this. And you can still nice. side your cord, and it doesn't stop it from shutting. So I guess that's what I'm gonna do. Kind of keep it a little bit cleaner, stuff like that. Let's do a little quick update of the shop yep. while we're here. down in the description below for those um, or you can buy them from them directly whatever you want if you order directly from them it does take a little while I'm not sure exactly how long I bought it back in August last year so um, what I may do is I may buy 
some and have some inventory that way it's a lot less time for shipping and all that kind of stuff or, or lead time on going out to deliveries so anyways hopefully y'all enjoyed this video if y'all liked it please make sure to hit that like and subscribe um, and comment down below let me know what your thoughts are on it is if you've used it before let me know what y'all think if y'all have it and y'all would like one comment down below i think it's pretty cool technology my 2021 gmc denali and the high country on the 21s both had wireless carplay already from the factory so now all my 21 trucks will have wireless carplay see y'all next time